As the first leaf came off the production line at Nissan's Sunderland plant, the Prime Minister was there to see for himself the fruits of the company's £420 million investment to build the 100% electric car in the northeast of England. It is a huge privilege as the British Prime Minister to be here at this incredible plant today and celebrating this incredible new car. This plant, all of the people who work here, the cars being produced behind me, are the best possible rebuke to those who say that in Britain we can't design things anymore, we can't make things anymore, we can't export things anymore. You've shown here at Nissan in Sunderland that we can and we can do it brilliantly. The new Leaf boasts 100 improvements and uses an advanced lithium-ion battery which is also manufactured at the Sunderland plant. The ceremony marks the culmination of four years of preparation, which is supporting more than 2,000 jobs in the UK car industry, 500 of them at Sunderland. Nissan says it highlights the company's commitment to manufacturing cars for the European market in Europe. We're really excited to get this car into our dealers so that European customers can see just how much fun it is to drive and how much money they can save by never, never having to go to a petrol station ever again. Mr Cameron was given a tour of the plant, as well as meeting staff who will work on the new car. Nissan says the new Leaf, the world's best-selling electric vehicle, is now even better. The 2013 model has more than 100 improvements aimed at making Nissan's zero-emission technology accessible to even more European drivers. Updates include an increased driving range of 123 miles, or 199 kilometres, and the ability to recharge in half the time of the first-generation LEAF. The launch comes as the Sunderland plant celebrates the production of 7 million vehicles since it opened in 1986. More than 510,000 were produced in 2012, the most ever vehicles produced by a UK car factory in a year. More than 54,000 LEAFs have been sold worldwide, Nissan says the new LEAF is the first in a number of pure electric vehicles that it plans to launch over the next few years.